Hey guys, Agile Fox here. We have received information today regarding the brand new set coming to Japan, S6A. Eevee Heroes is the name. It looks epic. Let's dive in. So Eevee Heroes was trademarked back in December. It was highly speculated it was going to be a brand new set and today it has been officially revealed. So PokeGuardian.com posted this article this morning. I'll leave a link down below so you guys can check it out yourselves. Evolutions will take the spotlight in May. The previously trademarked Eevee Heroes name will be coming as a set. Now S6A Eevee Heroes has been revealed to be the set after S6H Silver Lance and S6K Jet Black Poltergeist, which we spoke about on the channel last month i'll leave a link to that video as well this set will as you may have noticed focused around evolutions from the dummy pack art we can expect that vaporeon v jolteon v flareon v espion v umbreon v leafeon v glaceon v and sylveon v will be in ev heroes so this is going to be absolutely epic i'm going to need about a thousand umbreons this set will contain 69 cards plus secret rares the set will release on may 28th 2021 the price will be 4950 yen and one booster box includes 30 packs one pack includes five cards so this is sounding awesome to me. I'm super excited to dive in. There is more information as well, guys. All evolutions will appear as stated earlier, and they will be Ichigeki, which is single strike, and Rengeki, which is rapid strike cards too. So they're not only cute, but they're strong too. It's sure to draw in not just card collectors and players, but also casual Pokemon fans. Now we do have this additional information about a VMAX special set EV Heroes which will release on the very same day. It's a set that will be similar to the VMAX special set. It contains 8 packs of S6A EV Heroes and 1 VMAX promo pack which contains 1 VMAX out of the 4 and 3 Hollow Foil energy cards. We also have new information regarding high class decks. We've had Gengar VMAX and Inteleon VMAX revealed. Here's what we know so far. So Gengar VMAX will be darkness type to represent its poison typing from the video games. This is the first time it's been anything other than psychic. Two copies of VMAX, Gengar or Inteleon are in each deck. You get playable Ichigeki and Rengeki cards, so that's Rapid Strike and Single Strike. New supporter cards are included and it'll be playable in various decks. A guide of how to use the deck is also included. So with these high class decks, you're getting 60 foil cards, which is really awesome. Three Pokemon V and two VMAX cards are in each deck. Playable cards will be available with new illustrations. So really exciting, especially if you're just getting into the TCG like I am. Starting to learn the ropes now and I will definitely be picking these up. So guys, do let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'd love to know. I'm super excited. I hope you are too. Let's go and find a chunky Pikachu. Okay guys, it's that time where I try and find the Rainbow Rare Chonky Chew. So, last week we did get the Pikachu V, which was really nice. Um, but we are still waiting to find a secret rare from this booster box. So I think we've only had uh, two Ultra Rares so far. So, I feel like the last half of this box is going to, well, potentially be stacked. I don't want to jinx it. But uh, we have a Loudred, first of all. We've got a beautiful Machop, a Sableye a Cottony and a Surfetched V. There we go. So there is another ultra rare pool and a wonderful way to end the episode. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs>